If you have problems with staying consistent when it comes to Pinterest, this video is for you. So what is the secret when it comes to consistency? Is it about some fancy tools that you need to pay for or is it about some secret knowledge that you have to obtain? Well, no, you just have to be organized. And today I want to show you a completely free tool that can make you much more organized when it comes to Pinterest. I created it today and it's nothing spectacular, but I'm pretty sure that for some people, for some viewers of my channel, this can actually help. Before I show you how it works, I want to invite you to my school community. If you are serious about growing on Pinterest and you want to scale your traffic, check out the link in the description. Inside the community, you will find a lot of useful information, a lot of valuable prompts and my custom tools. I launched the community a couple of days ago and we already have people from all over the world. So who knows, maybe someone from your country is already in the community and two of you can connect and talk about blogging and Pinterest. But for now, let's come back to the tool that I created today. Let me show you how it works. So I created this simple tool where you can just paste your URLs here and it's going to give us a spreadsheet with a schedule for the next couple of months. First of all, you need to gather all of the URLs of your articles and the easiest way to do it is by going to your sitemap. If you have a WordPress blog, you probably have a sitemap already. So for example, if your domain would be example.com, if you go to slash sitemap.xml or something like post sitemap, dot xml you will be able to access your sitemap once you have the list you can just paste everything here i'm just using example.com and some random stuff here generated by chat gpt you can just paste your links here and click continue now you will have to decide how many pins per day are you planning to post and how many times you want to repeat the whole process trust me it's going to make sense in a minute once you click generate schedule you are going to see a massive list of all of the urls from your list assigned to specific days. And now, as you can see, we have a plan for the next three months, I believe, because the last day at the bottom of this page is day 97, 13 of July. And what's important, once you generate the list, you can also click on that green button to download the CSV file with everything that's here. Maybe it's nothing spectacular, but if you want to stay organized, this simple and most importantly free tool can help you with that because now you know exactly what kind of URLs you should post on what day. It's a super simple spreadsheet, just the date and the URL, but now everything's organized and I know exactly what I should do on each day up until the mid July. You have to remember that Pinterest values consistency. So if you are consistent and if you are regularly adding new pins and you are following your schedule, it can actually help you build traffic very fast. If you want to test it out for yourself, the link is in the description, it's completely free. And of course, if you want me to help you with your Pinterest strategy, you can join the Pin Lions community. The link is also in the description, it's affordable so anyone can join. So if you want your stats to look like this, 170K clicks in the last 90 days, I encourage you to become a pin lion. That's pretty much it for today, guys. Thanks for watching. Hopefully this video was helpful. And if it was, consider subscribing to my channel. See you next time.